Hello guys, today I'm gonna check out this Master Watt 650 Watt semi fanless modular power supply by Cooler Master. Now, don't be scared, this is an 80 plus bronze certified unit. So, this means it's more of an entry level PSU, but it should be pretty quiet and quite reliable, at least that's what Cooler Master says. We are getting a 5 year warranty here, and this Master Watt series is the successor to their previous GM lineup of power supplies. This specific 600 and 50 watt version currently comes in at roughly 95 US dollars. First of all, what are the actual differences or improvements over the GM lineup? Well, this master watt unit is now equipped with a quiet silencio fan that will only spin up once the PSU exceeds a load of 15%, making this unit semi-passive. Also neat is the fact that all these cables are black now, those PCIe cables now are modular as well, and these PCIe cables feature a higher wire gauge of 16 AWG. And last but not least, 5 cm longer cables, as well as more SATA connectors on the 650 and 750 watt versions. Now, the 650 watt model comes with a single plus 12 volt rail design, 54 amps on that rail, 22 on the plus 3.3 and 5 volt rails, respectively. Of course, as one would expect, all the needed protections and lots and lots of connectivity, especially the amount of SATA connectors. From the looks of it, this master watt unit does look better than the previous. GM models by Cooler Master and the all black modular flat ribbon cables and braided cables on the power supply do make a very good impression. As for the cable length, it's perfect, long enough even for bigger PC cases. The 24 and 8 pin cables are the only permanently attached cables here, the rest is all modular. But in order to really determine the quality of a PSU, one has to open it up and look at the used components. Please be warned, opening up power supplies can be extremely dangerous. The fan, as I've said before, doesn't spin up at light loads, and once it does, it's really quiet. The OEM that manufactured this unit is HEC, and Chinese TPO capacitors are used for both the primary and secondary side. These obviously aren't the best choice in terms of reliability, but caps many, many PSUs in this price range come with. So while not the best, fairly decent nonetheless. Unfortunately, I do not have the possibility of professionally testing power supply units, but I did run some simple tests. I did measure the voltage at some load and also did measure the power consumption consumption of the test system. Compared to 80 plus gold efficiency, you're definitely losing out on some efficiency there, but for being a bronze unit, it does remarkably well. Basically, to sum it up, the Master Watt 650 Watt is a very decent, quiet, semi-passive, more or less entry-level power supply for those of you on a budget, but with a relatively power-hungry system. This unit does the job just fine, runs perfectly stable, and despite its bronze efficiency, it's still quite efficient. Yeah, sure, it would've been nice if Cooler Master, or rather the OEM HEC, actually decided to go with better capacitors, but at the end of the day, you shouldn't worry about it too much. You're getting a 5 year warranty, which definitely shows Cooler Master's confidence in this PSU. The pricing compared to similar modular units out there is okay. So I definitely can recommend this Cooler Master Master Watt 650 Watt power supply. I'm giving it my silver award. And as always, thanks for watching.